Hello, Sagittarius. Okay, I already did the cards. The camera had cut off. So, welcome to my channel. If you guys did not hear me say this, hit the notification below. If you want to become a, um, if you want to know when I post a video, hit the join button to become a member. Welcome to the viewers. Welcome to my channel. Subscribe. I'd love for you to become a subscriber, okay? You guys hit the like and share. Thank you. I really appreciate that. If you do, okay, I dropped nine cards. All right, so they're ready. I'm going to place the cards. False person. Distant horizon. Privileged lady. Uh, occupation. Pathway. Great fortune. House. Coffin. And courthouse. Okay, so I'm going to look at the cards and see what's going on in you guys' story. All right. I'm going to give you the story off top. And then I'm going to clarify the cards. Clarify the, yeah, clarify the cards. And the story can change when I do this. But you can also resonate with the other story as well if it does change. But it's definitely going to go more in depth, okay? Either way it goes. It's going to go more in depth. So let me see what's going on. So you're not, somebody is seeing somebody is not being who they are, a false person, okay? Somebody may be seeing you as being a false person, not being who you are. Privileged lady. Yeah, they feel like you're hiding something or someone, okay, or how you feel. Okay, but they see you as being spoiled, having everything you want, anything you want, privileged lady. Okay, you may have ended things with this person in the past. You may have had stability with this person as well. You guys may have lived together. Hmm, 32. You guys could have even been married. There's somebody you may have divorced or separated from, if not divorced. Great fortune. This person that may have seen you as having a great fortune. Or you may have been fortunate to have this person in your life. Or they may have felt this way about you. 34. This person may have been worked in the home. Pathway. This person may have been intuitive. Or. Yeah, this person could have been intuitive. Or this was divinely guided. You guys were divinely guided, or you're you're being divinely guided back towards this person. But there's a lot of maybe emotional distance between you guys. It's hard to get back to this person because there's a lot of emotional distance and there's the stumbling blocks in the way. It's just hard to get there. It's going slow. Or this is you trying to get you are trying to get back to this person. Hmm. You might be seeing somebody as being spoiled. Hmm. Let's see what is not real. That's what I'm seeing off top. So let me clarify. Clarify the false person concerning Sagittarius. Clarify false person. Okay, temperance. Somebody's trying to get some insight on you. On what's, what, what you're hiding. 
when something's being hidden and something's not real, so somebody's trying to get some insight concerning you. Maybe you hide it how you feel about this person. Maybe you hold a lot of passion for them, but you hide it. Clarify the temperance concerning Sagittarius. And they're trying to get some insight on how you truly feel about them. They're having a hard time. Their car. Maybe before they end things with you. Maybe they're thinking about ending things with you. And this may be a Libra. You may be dealing with a Libra. And they're trying to get some insight on how um, you feel about them. Because they think you're hiding how you feel. Or you are. And this person is maybe ending things because you're hiding how you truly feel about them. Clarify death. I'm going to do one more part. Clarify death concerning Sagittarius. I'm going to do it over. I should have kept that card. I think I was supposed to keep that card. But it'll come back out. Let me shuffle. Mm. Clarify death concerning Sagittarius. Clarify death concerning Sagittarius. Okay, yeah, the stability. But they're holding on to you for stability or you... You feel like they're holding on to you just for stability, but you may you're thinking about ending things because you feel this person is holding on to you um, for the stability. You may think this person is greedy after your stability, and you're trying to get insight to see how they if they have any feelings at all for you. This person wants to be. This person may want to be a privileged lady. They may want to be spoiled. They may want you to give them everything. Or this is what you're seeing, how they want you to treat them like a privileged lady. Yeah, you're seeing them as greedy. Clarify. Or the person is seeing you as greedy. The person could be seeing you as greedy. This Libra, Scorpio. They may have Scorpio on their chart. They may be seeing you as greedy, wanting their stability. Because they can't see how you feel. They're trying to get insight on how you feel about them. Clarify privilege lady concerning um, Sagittarius. Clarify. Okay, three cards. Okay. The chariot. This is a cancer. Yeah. They they see you being spoiled, wanting everything. Okay. Or this is what they do to you. They give you everything, whatever you want. Okay? Because they want to move forward in a um success with you. The chariot. This may be a cancer. They have Libra and Scorpio in their chart. Yep. But they're trying to get clarity on how you truly feel about them. They want to know if you truly have feelings about them or are you just wanting the stability? Okay, five of swords. Okay. They're feeling the, the sense of defeat on getting this, trying to get this out of you, how you feel. They're feeling the sense of defeat. Okay. And they're thinking about ending things because they don't know how you truly feel. They don't want to be used. Okay, they feel you may use them. You may be using them. Or switch it how it resonates. Clarify coffin. Clarify coffin concerning Sagittarius' energy. Clarify coffin. Yeah. They are your fulfillment to you. Okay, you're hiding it. The Ace of Cups. Or you're their fulfillment. And they, yeah, you're there for fulfillment. They do want stability with you. They want to live with you. Or this is how you feel and you're hiding it from them. Clarify house. 
by how the sun is Sagittarius. Okay, yeah. Um, three of rods. This person may have turned their back on another situation, waiting on something better. This is you're their fulfillment. They've always been waiting on somebody like you. Right? They just sit and they have wishful thinking of concerning you. This person. Oh, this supposed to be on house. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Hmm. If this person is married to someone else, they're thinking about going to the courthouse and getting a divorce, or they're thinking about marrying you if they don't have anybody else. They they have courthouse on their mouth. They think about going to get them papers. You two getting married. If not, if they have somebody else, they're thinking about separating or divorcing from that person so they can move forward with you. Clarify courthouse. Clarify courthouse concerning Sagittarius. Okay, yeah. They're manifesting you. The magician. Look at this courthouse. This person is manifesting you. Or they manifested you. Clarify magician. They may not have Aries as well in their chart. Or carrying the energy. Clarify the magician. Knight of Cups. Yeah, this person is offering you love. Coming in to offer love to you. Or they're trying to. But you keep hiding how you feel. Or this could be what you want. You want marriage from this person. You manifested this person. And you want this what you wanted. This person to offer you love. This could be something you wanted. You manifested. But then you're over here hiding how you feel. Somebody's hiding how they feel. Clarify the great fortune concerning Sagittarius. Yes, yeah, somebody sees this person as a great fortune in their life. You or them. Or just okay, the high priestess, but nobody's saying nothing. Nobody's expressing it to each other. Maybe both of you feel this way, but you you guys are not expressing it to each other. You're just using your intuition trying to figure it out. Somebody has to express it to be able to move forward, not just think it and feel it. You have to express it as well to be able to have some forward movement. Occupation. This person may have somebody that works in the home. That works at home. So they may do have somebody else. This person. But they see you as their fulfillment. So they may be ending things with who? The person that works in the home. So they could be with their fulfillment. Their Ace of Cups. Clarify. Clarify the occupations. Clarify occupation concerning. Clarify occupation concerning Sagittarius. These little cards, but they're good. I like them. Clarify. Clarify occupation concerning Sagittarius. Clarify occupation. Okay, there we go. Yeah, they're married to somebody that works in the home. Their, their person works at home. They do some type of work at home. Some type of home work. Maybe they just do around the house. Okay, clarify the hair font concerning Sagittarius. Yeah, they're married. Clarify hair font concerning Sagittarius. Yeah, Wheel of Fortune. Hmm. Karma. Maybe they're, they're, these two are going through a karma situation. Them and their spouse, they're going through some type of karma situation. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune concerning Sagittarius and Homemaker. Clarify the Wheel of Fortune concerning 
Wheel of Fortune and Homemaker. Okay, three cards. Yeah, this person is mentally stuck. Okay, on how to move forward with their person. Okay. Because their person is fighting them all. Yeah. They're going through a common situation. They're, they're mentally stuck on how to move forward with their person because they're fighting them all. Pathway. Okay. Something is divinely um divinely guided. Maybe this karma situation is the, the divine is allowing this to take place. Clarify the pathway concerning Sagittarius's energy. Clarify. Or you need to follow your intuition in a situation. Oh no, that this is who it was. Yeah. This Aquarius is this is an Aquarius that they're dealing with. And this person is intuitive. They're divinely guided. They allow themselves to be divinely guided. And they cut this person off. This is divinely guided. Yep. With him and their spouse. Clarify, for some reason, it's divinely guided. Clarify the Queen of Swords. Clarify the Queen of Swords. Concerning pathway. That's too many cards still. Clarify the Queen of Swords concerning pathway. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And somebody's making a choice. Somebody, there's an Aries, I mean, a fire sign involved. So they made a choice. They, they cut their spouse off. And they made a choice between somebody at a distance from them, a fire sign. There's a fire sign that is moving. Um, who made a choice over somebody else. They picked this Aquarius over somebody else and they're coming in. This is God, divinely guided. Clarify this to the floor. This is divinely guided for some reason. Clarify this to the floor. Concerning Sagittarius. Yep. This person is highly passionate about this Queen of Swords. Yep. And they've been holding on to this person. Clarify the Queen of Swords. Concerning Pathway. I mean, oh, nope, not that one. Clarify the King of Wands. Concerning Pathway. Nine of Pentacles, yeah, they, they see this person as they see this Queen of Swords being abundant, standing their ground, being beautiful, you know, independent. That's how they see them. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles concerning pathway. Clarify the Nine of Pentacles. Oh yeah. They've been doing a, this is an emperor person. They've been doing a lot of inner reflecting on this Queen of Swords. Okay. Oh. This could be, they could have been in a third party situation with each other in the past, but they no longer want to be separated from this Queen of Swords. So they're coming in. They're choosing to move where this Queen of Swords is. Clarify the Three of Swords. Somebody was heartbroken. They may be heartbroken because um, they don't have this Queen of Sword in their life. They don't. They don't like the distance that's between them. Clarify the Three of Swords concerning pathway and Sagittarius energy. And this could be a Sagittarius with energy. Yep. So their person. Yep. So they're healing things. They're going to have some open communication with this Queen of Swords that they already had. Yeah. If they broke the Queen of Swords heart in the past, they're, hit, they're apologizing, wanting their forgiveness, wanting to heal things with them. All right. Things are moving slow with them. Mm-hmm. 
somebody may be, a bit, be stuck in a situation or they see this queen of swords being stuck right so things are going slow between this person between them So this may take a while for this to happen, but this has been divinely guided, the situation. But it's, it's going to be a slow process. So if somebody's waiting on this person's spouse, it's going to be a while before this spouse is released. Clarify distant horizon. Clarify distant horizon and Sagittarius' energy. Okay, he dropped again. Somebody keep dropping the balls. Huh? Yeah, the king of sword. But when they do come in, they're going to shake up. When it happens, it's going to make a big change. It's going to be a big shake up. This person coming in, they may have Gemini in their chart. They're coming in to shake up things. When they get come, it's coming. But things are going to get shook up. It's going to be a big change in somebody's life. Clarify the King of Swords. Sagittarius' energy. Clarify the King of Swords. Sagittarius' energy. Yeah, this is going to be a big change. It's going to make a big change. Yep, Knight of Pentacles. This person is coming in, planning, plotting, strategizing. Yep. How to offer this pinnacle to this... um. Queen of Swords, it's Aquarius. So they're coming in to shake up things. They're going to shake up things. It's going to be a big major change. So you may get what you want, Sag. If this is what you want, this is the person that you want. Or vice versa. If that's what they want, if they want you, they're going to get what they want. Because this person coming in to shake things up, to break things up. Somebody world going to be turned upside down. Or nobody. Everybody going to get what they want. Everybody may get what they want. All right? Okay, so this was a crazy read, all right? So Sagittarius, you guys, hit the notification button below. If you want to be notified when I post a video, hit the join button. If you want to become a member as well, like, share my video, subscribe, 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 you guys. Thank you for tuning in. I love you guys. I hope you didn't get confused with the reading, but yeah, somebody coming in to shake up some things, but it's on the other side. This is your read, but this Queen of Swords took your read clean over. At the end, somebody coming in for this person, you want their spouse, or their spouse wants you, or y'all want each other, and somebody's coming for them. So they're actually, the person coming for them is the one that's going to shake things up and just change things. It's going to be a big shake up. So that's where it's going to come. This is all being divinely guided. All right. So... I love you guys. Be good. All right. I hope you enjoyed the read. All right. Subscribe, like, share. Thank you.